So if any of you missed the OG stress resolution that used to be playable back in 2018, well I've got some great news for you because I've found a cheeky little glitch that will allow all of you to get a very similar looking res and FOV to what we used to love and miss of 2018, which is awesome. And this is right now in Fortnite Chapter 3, or at least until Epic Games patches it, which I unfortunately think will be soon after they do see this video or rather similar videos. But anyway, let's go ahead and get straight into the tutorial. So the first thing you guys want to do is actually set up a stretch resolution which is just normal to how all of you do it right now to do it all you have to do is go over to your desktop press the windows key plus r at the same time and then a run box like this should appear once it's appeared you just want to type in the following command that's percentage sign local app data and then percentage sign just like that press ok after doing that guys you should see a fortnite um, game folder just press f and it should appear like this open up that open up saved open up config and then open up windows client and you should see the config file right there called game user settings now before editing this and actually changing the resolution you want to right click on it go properties and make sure the read only box is unchecked before making any changes once you've done that click apply click ok and then we can now right click on it and click edit and in here guys you want to simply find the resolution section which it should be down here somewhere. There's mine right there. As you can see, I'm rocking the default resolution. That's 1920 by 1080. But we're going to go ahead, guys, and add the stretched resolution 1750. Not 59, 50. You need to make sure both of them match. It's very, very important. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and save the file. Go file. Click save. Close it down. And then before we do exit this, you want to go ahead and right click on it. Click properties. And then make sure read only is selected. This is to prevent Fortnite from making any automatic changes which can happen. So click read only. Press apply. Press OK, close it down, and before we open up Fortnite, we're going to go ahead and actually enable GPU scaling. Um, you want to go ahead, right click on your desktop, open up the NVIDIA control panel, and then before we actually change the resolution in itself, you want to go ahead and click adjust desktop size and positioning. And in here, you want to use full screen, and then you want to perform the scaling on your GPU, not on your CPU. You can also tick that box right there. Press apply and then before exit now you obviously want to go on to change resolution, click customize and we're going to go ahead and add this new resolution that we've just set up which is 1750 by 1080. Make sure you've got your correct refresh rate right there. Click on test and then after that guys you should see your stretched resolution appear at the top there. That's 1750. Press ok and then before open up Fortnite you want to go ahead and select this resolution and click apply. And just like that guys we are in the new stretched resolution. Now guys you can go ahead and open up Fortnite because it's now time to do the recent FOV glitch that I covered in this video right here. If you didn't watch that guys it's very simple to do. All you need to do is jump into a game of Fortnite and when the countdown goes from 10 to 0 when it reaches 0 you want to go ahead and slide and that will initiate the FOV glitch, as you can see on screen right here. But if we go ahead and land right now, guys, and actually run around, you can see how close this is to that OG stretch resolution that we all miss so, so much from back in the day of 2018 Fortnite Battle Royale. As you can see, if I compare the two right here, guys, it really does give that vibe and that feel of the OG stretch res, and I just think it's awesome that it's somewhat playable in Fortnite Chapter 3. Yes, it's not as good as it used to be. Obviously, the FOV back then was just insane. You could see everything. This one's a bit disorientated if you like it's a bit like to the left and it's not exactly centered as it used to be but it's the closest thing we can get guys and i think a lot of you out there will want to try this out again until fortnite do eventually patch it but yeah guys that's how you get the og stretched resolution or something that's very close to that in fortnite chapter 3 if this video did help you out then feel free to help me out back by dropping a like on the video subscribing to the channel and using code life in the fortnite item shop right now there's a ton of cool skins in there so if you pick any of these up i'd appreciate it greatly if you could use my creator code as that would help me out a turn. I'll catch you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.